Welcome back. Please share, subscribe, and comment. United Kingdom. Chelsea FC title. The heartbeat of Chelsea FC in the heart of West London. Amidst the hum of city life and the towering echoes of history lies Stamford Bridge, home to Chelsea Football Club. Beyond just a football team, Chelsea FC stands as a symbol of triumph, resilience, and passion for millions. But it wasn't always this way. To understand the search for the beating heart of Chelsea, one must look back at the past, delve into the present, and dream of the future. Prologue The origins of the Blue Chelsea FC was founded in 1905, emerging from the smoke and soot of a bustling, industrialized London. The club quickly became known for its fearless spirit and determination, attributes that resonated deeply with the working-class supporters of the time. However, as the years rolled on, football in the UK transformed into more than just a game. It became a fervor, a cultural phenomenon that solidified the club's identity. Chapter 1. Rise from the shadows as the 20th century unfolded, Chelsea oscillated between profitable seasons and disheartening defeats. It was a turbulent time marked by relegation, financial crises, and doubts about the club's future. Yet, the arrival of Ken Bates in 1982 marked a turning point. With his brazen personality, he pulled the club from the brink of bankruptcy and breathed new life into its fortunes. Chelsea began to attract talented players, and the club started its rise through the ranks of English football. The fans, known as the Blues, played an essential role during this era. They were more than spectators. They were passionate supporters whose chants and unwavering belief filled the air on match days. Chelsea was their sanctuary, a place where dreams and reality collided. The heartbeats of these supporters synchronized with the rhythm of the game, creating an unbreakable bond that ran through the streets of Fulham to the far corners of the world. Chapter 2. The Transformation the dawn of the 21st century heralded a new chapter for Chelsea FC. In 2003, Russian billionaire Roman Abramovich acquired the club, injecting an unprecedented level of investment. The aura of Chelsea changed dramatically. Suddenly, the whispers of greatness materialized into deeds. The club transformed into a footballing powerhouse, stocked with world-class talent and elite management. But as success surged, so did expectations. The supporters who once rallied with fervor now grappled with the insatiable hunger for trophies and glory. What drove this pursuit? Was it the legacy of a club with a rich history, or the desire of the fans to stake their claim as part of something legendary? The pressure was palpable. Every match, every season, was filled with the hopes and dreams of countless souls who called Chelsea their own. Chapter 3. Keeping the faith despite the glimmering accolades and extensive trophy cabinets, the club faced its share of challenges. The 2010 saw a mix of triumphs and trials, proving that even the mightiest giants face storms. The departure of beloved managers, player clashes, and fluctuating performance levels contributed to a sense of uncertainty among the fan base. Yet, through it all, the Blues held on to their faith. Behind the goals and the goals conceded lay a grassroots community that remained vibrant. The Chelsea Foundation active in initiatives for social change, education, and inclusivity brought together fans, players, and the community. It was a reminder that beyond the matches and the millions on the pitch lay a profound connection with the people of London. Fans traveled far and wide, not just to see their team win, but to bond with fellow supporters to create shared memories drenched in camaraderie. Chapter 4. A search for identity as the decade turned and football continued to evolve with technology, analytics, and a global audience. Chelsea FC entered a new phase of searching for its identity. Who were the Blues in a world increasingly influenced by data and branding? What did it mean to support Chelsea in an era of financial tactics and international marketing? Fans began to understand that Chelsea was more than a club. It was a cultural movement, a tapestry woven from hope, heartbreak, rivalry, and celebration spanning generations. The search for the why behind their unwavering support grew from this collective understanding. Their loyalty wasn't merely to a team, but to a legacy, a narrative built brick by brick, filled with passion and pride. Epilogue 
The future is blue in 2023, with the landscape of football shifting yet again. Chelsea FC stands at a crossroads, one foot in a storied history, and the other reaching towards an uncertain future. The club is once again in a phase of rebuilding. The fans are restless yet hopeful. They gather in pubs and homes, their conversations echoing through the streets of Chelsea, reminiscing about past glories while envisioning future triumphs. As the sun sets over Stamford Bridge, a new generation prepares to embrace the legacy of Chelsea FC. The reasons driving this search for identity remain fundamental. Community, resilience, love for the game, and the unyielding spirit of keep the blue flag flying high. The pulse of Chelsea FC continues to beat strongly, resonating with every chant and cheer in a stadium that feels more like home than ever. And so the journey continues. Just as the barriers were broken down by the likes of Bobby Tamblin and John Franco Zola, the stadium remains the sanctum where dreams are born, and the search for meaning in football, forever enthralling, will never cease. Chelsea FC isn't just a club. It is a tapestry of stories, driven by a passion that forever unites its people as they march boldly into a vibrant and hopeful future.